Hi everyone, in this uh, video I'm just going to explain you how you can create uh, laser custom alerts uh, within uh, Matomo Analytics. So by laser custom alerts I mean uh, the alerts that you are creating uh, over here with uh, several conditions. So by default, as you can uh, see here, uh, you can just define one condition for your alerts within Matomo Analytics. And uh, in fact, the little trick that we are going to use here is that we are going to create a custom reports with uh, some, uh, let's say, uh, filters within it that we can then uh, reuse afterwards. So for this, uh, you will need to be familiar with uh, how to create a custom uh, report. So you need, of course, to look through the developer documentation, but I already uh, created a video tutorial about it. Uh, in order to add, in fact, uh, over here, all the different custom reports that uh, you would like to add. Then, uh, regarding the uh, custom report that uh, you're going to use, for, for example, in my case, it's named Friends. If I look at it uh, within the code, uh, this is uh, how I did it. So I, I did it this way. So this uh, report is just uh, showing, in fact, the value dealing with uh, the, the fronts. So if I just, uh, for example, do it like this, if I just go uh, over here, you will see that I'm getting all uh, the visits coming from from France. You see, oops, if I do something like this, I see that here I have uh, 313 visits, which is exactly the same number as the one that uh, we can find uh, over here. Okay, but how can I, in fact, filter those uh, visits? Well, in fact, I can uh, filter those by just um, just changing uh, the code. So I got this trick by Lucas uh, Winkler, and thank you so much uh, for this. In fact, I can filter all those data out by adding a segment without creating the segment in itself within uh, Matomo Analytics. And here I can specify, in fact, the different condition on which I would like my segments to apply and this refer to the following documentation the one that you can see here where you see in fact uh, the different um, let's say main uh, indicator and then the value which are expected so in my case I created a segment like this where the browser name needs to be Firefox country name needs to be France and visit local hour need to be 11 so it's kind of a huge uh, segment that I did here and if I apply it by just saving the document you will see that the number of visits uh, will drop and it will represent only the people which are coming from France, which are on Firefox and which came on my website at uh, 11 hour. And as a result, because I created this specific uh, report based on this specific segment or filter, whatever you call, you call it, you can then afterward uh, create an alert and this alert so uh, you're just going to select in fact the report that you created which is the one of uh, France and as a result so I can just um, go over here and select the one which is named France and in fact it's going to apply to uh, the one that I uh, that I define and then the number of let's say visitor is more greater than that one and then it's going to send me an alert if uh, one visitor is matching those criteria which are coming at 11 a.m. Uh, coming from France and as well using uh, Firefox. And hope you understood this uh, tutorial and hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.